Ladies and gentlemen, commissioners and staff, welcome to the 28th of October 2013 public hearing meeting of the Greater Lyons Planning Commission. I now call this meeting to order. As most of you are aware, the Planning Commission serves as an advisory body to the local governments regarding land use requests. The determination made here tonight will be forwarded to the applicable local government as recommendations. We are a recommended body only. Final determinations regarding to tonight's request will be made by the appropriate local government at their respective meeting. Even if the Planning Commission recommends denying or tabling of an item, it will still go to the local government for final decision. All interested persons should attend the local government public hearing meeting regarding these requests. All of the cases we will review tonight are listed on the agenda, which is available on the podium located at the back of the room where you enter. If you did not pick up a copy when you enter, you may do so now. Also, during the meeting, I will call each request in the order that they appear on the agenda. Staff will then present their report regarding the request and give their recommendation. The commissioners may have discussion with at the staff at that time. I will next call for those wishing to speak in favor of the request and then for those wishing to speak against the request. If you wish to speak in regard to a request, please come forward at the appropriate time, state your name, and your address, and then give your presentation. Fairness and equity to both sides is our goal. State laws requires that we allow 10 minutes for each side of an issue. <clears throat> if you, in the interest of time, we may ask you to keep your comments brief so that all who wish to speak may have time to be heard. We also ask that information given by our prior speaker not be repeated. If you choose to speak in regards of an application, please direct all comments to the Planning Commission Board only. Do not direct comments to the staff, to the applicants, or to those in the audience. Do not turn toward the audience or solicit debate from others. Please keep all comments proper, polite, and to the point. Once public participation is closed and all further discussion of an application is, re is reserved to the Planning Commission. The handout previously is previously mentioned also include a copy of the standards of exercises zoning powers, which are the guidelines we use to determine whether a request is consistent with the comprehensive plan. These standards are significant fa factors we use in making our re final recommendations. The handouts also include a copy of the Georgia's conflict of interest in zoning law guidelines. All planning commission members will be asked to excuse themselves from acting on any matter in which they have a conflict by stating so at the beginning of that case. Final action on tonight's applicant application will be held as follows. For the Lowndes County cases, Tuesday, November the 12th at 5.30 at the Lowndes County Judicial and Administrative Complex. On our Dasher City case, Monday the 4th of November at 6 o'clock p.m. at Dasher City Hall. Um, our city hate hire cases. The hate hire case, which is item number three on your mm -hmm. agenda, has been withdrawn by the applicant. Okay. So the city of Valdosta case, Thursday, the 7th of November at 5.30 at the city of Valdosta Hall. We appreciate your attention to the housekeeping issues and again, welcome you to our meeting. Now we'd like 